in the course of debate on the counter-terrorism bill, Senator Hanson's contribution was awash with racist language, yep. including some despicable yep. race-based personal remarks about Senator Faruqi. Right. Senator Hanson needs to withdraw these remarks and apologise unconditionally. What I said, we heard Marine Faruqi's disgust of Israel and what they have done to protect themselves, though their retaliation through the, um, they said, we've had enough. We've had, we have had a gutful of this and now they are defending themselves. Good on them. I don't blame them. But the fact is that it's a pity that Marine Faruqi. Uh, Senator didn't... Hanson, please refer. Well, I'm reading from what I said. Okay, Mitt, what I said. Well, Senator Hanson. Well, I'll say, Senator well then Hanson. I will say, Senator, Senator Hanson, Faruqi. please resume your seat. I was not in the chamber when you made the, that contribution. I am in the chamber now, and I am directing you to refer to the senator by her correct name. Well, then I'll, this is Hansard, but anyway, all right, we'll go to Senator Faruqi. Didn't look at what Pakistan did to two million Afghan people there. They just went in, bulldozed their homes, said, go back to Afghanistan. Uh, Senator Hanson, please resume. What about those people? Senator Hanson, please resume your seat. Senator Waters. Uh, point of order, merely repeating what is already on the hand side that we've all had the displeasure of reading and that we are currently complaining breaches, standing orders and the code of conduct. Simply repeating those comments takes us no further to a solution. If, as long as she remains within the standing orders and, and like all senators, not make personal reflections on other senators, she, was, she is within the standing orders. Senator Hanson. Thank you. So I said, where is the fear for them? Oh no, that's right. Pakistan is the country that she came from, so we can't criticise the Pakistanis, can we? No, not at all. And, and I Senator said, Senator Hanson, Fruit, yes. in the same way that I reminded Senator Waters, this matter is about why this matter is urgent. Uh, so I would ask you to address your comments right. to the urgency motion. Thank you. Okay. So my comments reference back to what Senator Waters was saying. I said, Senator Faruqi, I will tell you again, if you don't see yourself as loving, as loving this country and abiding by the laws of the country, I have no problem. I will actually take you um, to the Senator airport. Hanson, but that, you to... Senator Hanson, that was a personal reflection. I'm going to ask you to withdraw that. Um, well, that's a serious matter. Let me think about it. Oh, Senator, Let me think about it. Order. 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 Look, um, Senator Fruki, there's a tissue uh, here Order. For you, if you like. Senator Hanson. Order. Senator Hanson, please resume your seat. You made a personal reflection. It's not up for debate. I've asked you to withdraw that, and I remind you again, you need to withdraw. I used to make those same statements at immigration ceremonies Senator to Hanson, people, and they thought Senator it was Hanson, they please, Senator Hanson, please resume your seat. You are not debating with me. You have made a personal reflection. It is not in accordance with the standing orders. I have asked you, I have directed you to withdraw that statement. I simply ask you to withdraw without making any further comment. I believe I'm speaking on behalf of millions of Australians, and Senator no, Hanson, I won't. Senator Hanson, Senator Hanson, please. That is a very serious matter. I've, you have breached the standing orders. I'm asking you to take a few moments and reflect on what I've asked you. In fact, what I've directed you to do, and that is to withdraw that personal reflection. It doesn't matter what you may have said outside of the chamber, but we all have to abide by the standing orders in here, including me. And you have made a personal reflection on a senator, and I ask that you withdraw those remarks. When I expect senators in place to respect the Australian people and our laws and senator our values, Hanson. I will. Uh, Senator Hanson, I'm withdrawing the call from you.